know everyone, these are stories happening around the world. Senegal's pink lake, Lake Redba in Senegal, is the only pink lake in Africa. It attracts many tourists, but also is a good source of livelihood for the local community because of salt production, as in many other places of the world. Beautiful places like this lake have environmental risks. Every exploitation of this salt can cause serious damage to the ecosystem. Also, the fact that it's close to the Atlantic Ocean and moving dunes can cause irritation. Since 2005, the lake has been in the list for potential UNESCO heritage. We hope the local authorities take adequate measures to protect this beautiful lake. For our next news, paid for a husky and got a fox instead. A teenager in Lima, Peru wanted a pet dog for his family, so he went to buy a puppy at the informal market. He was offered a Siberian husky and happily paid for it. Back at home, everyone was happy with the puppy, but as it grew, things were becoming very suspicious. Some behaviors were very strange, and this pet was not even barking. Finally, they came to a conclusion that it was not a dog, but an Andean fox. One day, it escaped from the house and started its wildlife by killing ducks, chickens, and guinea pigs from the neighborhood. Such was the distress of the community that animal protection authorities had to intervene. It took many days for them to capture the fox. Now, the fox is a local zoo. Unbelievable. For our last news, India moving towards renewable energy. India, the second most populous country with 1.3 billion people and so to overtake China as the first, is one of the most vulnerable countries for climate change, but also needs a lot of energy production. Currently, most of its energy production is based on coal. But the country is committing to switch to renewable energies. A cornerstone to this plan is Badla Park, a huge oasis of solar panels almost the size of San Marino. This is a starting point, and if India wants to satisfy the energy demand of such a huge population, it needs to add a power system the size of all Europe. Huge challenge, but possible if there is willingness. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. This is Michael for MW Newscast on the latest news and updates.